Hey guys, welcome back. Tim Knox with Revolved Realty here with my buddy, Noel Bishop of Bishop 30 Solutions. Good. I said, last video I said, Bishop yeah. 30 Solutions, and that wasn't quite And the it. video before that, I was messing up. Uh, yeah. Words, so. yeah. Well, you know, that's what gives this character is the amount of uh, screw ups. That's true. <laughs> you, that's will. true. you know it's live. It is. Hey, yeah. we are talking about safety, personal safety, uh, being safe when you are out and about in public. Uh, you know, we what I call being safe in an unsafe world, and Noel is a an expert at that. Um, what I want to talk about on this video is the one thing that I think puts us in danger more than anything, and that is our cell phone. That's exactly talk right. Talk a little bit about that. If I'm, I'm always on my phone, whether I'm at the office, in the car, if I go into a grocery store, mm -hmm. and one thing that you advise is if you are in a public place like that and you're gonna get on the phone, Put your back against the wall at yep. least so you are kind of aware of what's going on, right? Right. So to talk on the phone itself is better than texting mm -hmm. because at least you, you have your head up and you can yeah. see what's going on. But if you get a phone call, mm -hmm. um, you, you, you've become more unaware, like we've discussed in some of the other right. videos, okay? Mm -hmm. You're a soft target. Mm -hmm. um, so eliminate the places that someone can get to you. Mm -hmm. So if you if you start talking on the phone, go up against the wall. Okay, so now you're looking at whoever or all the area that, that someone could do some harm to you. Right. Okay, they can't get you from behind because the wall's there. Mm -hmm. So I know it, you know, uh, it sounds kind of odd. You, know, you don't have to get on your phone and then go slam up against the wall, but I mean, you know, <laughs> just mosey on over yeah. there, eliminate, you know, where people can, can get to you. Yeah. You, you want to keep your head up and your your eyes moving around yep. because yep. what typically what people do and I I'm guilty of this when I get on the phone I pace with my head down yeah do you do right. that I'm, I'm like yeah. yeah I'm having a really serious yeah. conversation and you're, and you're thinking and I'm thinking and, and I'm yeah. walking all yeah. and and we've seen the videos people on their cell phone will walk into traffic oh yeah they'll walk in front of a subway yeah. train and I don't know why that makes me laugh no I, uh, well, but it's it's like you're focusing so much on the phone call or the conversation, you're not paying attention to anything right. else. And that's when you become uh, what we call the soft target. Right, and you, you've seen the videos. The guy's going along, talking on his cell phone, goes, falls into the fountain of water, Yes. you know? Yeah. I mean, that guy, if you do that, I mean, who's to say a bad guy couldn't do whatever he wanted to? Really? Yeah. I mean, he's so unaware. Yeah, and you have to really think like the bad guys. Yeah, Because you, you, you were talking about you're, you're the sheep and not the sheepdog or the wolf. Right. You know, the bad guys are, are on the lookout for people who are in a vulnerable moment mm -hmm. on the phone, texting, you know, going through a dark parking lot, not paying any attention, making themselves that easy target. So you really have to think, OK, I'm going into this situation. What are the dangers and how am I prepared? Right. And you have to use all of your senses. Right. OK. When you get on that cell phone, you are eliminating some of those senses yeah and you need them all to defend yourself yeah i gave them to you use them yeah you're instead of walking around like this right yeah right, okay right. Very good. Uh, and you know uh i remember the the shooting uh the las vegas shooting mm -hmm. uh the there was a policeman leading people out to a safe area and there were people that had their phones up filming what they were doing okay that's great it looks great on facebook and youtube mm -hmm. but they then have just cut down about 50 percent of their awareness and in that situation they needed all they could get right exactly okay. so the moral of the story is put your phone down when put you're your at phone the down mall. pay attention, pay attention. Like hey school. if uh, you need any help when it comes to self-defense Noel does uh one-on-one -on -one training group training schools churches how do they get in touch with you well, jump on my website, Bishop 30 Solutions, that's Bishop 30 Solutions, um, at oh, bishop30solutions.com. I'm Gee, sorry. We almost yeah. made it through without screwing yeah. up. Yeah. That was amazing. Don't leave it to me. Do you have uh, a phone number? Now? I do, if I can get through this. <laughs> it's 256 513 2280. Very good. And if I can be a service, do not hesitate to call me, 679 0704. Look me up on the web at revolved.com. Next time, we want to talk a little bit about uh, being alert in your vehicle. Yes. That's because very as, a, as a realtor, I'm in my car a lot. And a lot of the times, I have to admit, I'm not really aware of things going on around me. So we're going to talk about that coming up. Oh, sounds good.